Welcome to the Infernal Brotherhood's Willow series. Today I'm going to read the Willow comic adaptation number one of three. We'd like to invite you to subscribe to this channel for more Willow content and like and share the video. Number one in a three issue limited series, Willow, the official comic adaptation of the spectacular new movie from Lucasfilm. My daughter tells me that your child bears the mark, that she is the one the prophecy told of. But once my ritual is done, she will have no power over me. Give her to me. No. Where is the baby? It's gone. The midwife must have taken it. My daughter will destroy you, Bavmorda. You can't stop her. With all your sorceries and your Nogmar guards, your reign of terror is at an end. Find that baby, Sorcia. Use the death dogs and bring her back alive. Yes, mother. And somebody kill this woman. Even with all Bavmorda's forces ranged against them, the midwife manages to elude pursuit and keep the baby safe for many weeks. Until... No! No! You can't have her! The land of the Nelwins, sometime later. Dada! Dada! Come and see what we found! Rannan, Mims, you know I have to get the seeds in. But we found something in the river! Something important. You gotta see it. See? It's a baby. She's so cute. Can we keep her? No. It might be sick. Or dangerous. Leave it alone. It's a daikini. What's a daikini? Bigger than we are. Giants who live far away. Please, Prefect Burgocut. My husband isn't a thief. I know we haven't paid our debt to you, but... Only I sow the planting seeds around here. And I didn't sell him any. So where did... Kaya and the children and I gather those seeds ourselves in the forest, Mr. Burglecut. Willow, you didn't leave the children alone by the river. Ha! <laughs> but you'll never get your planting done before the rains start. Your lands will be mine in the end. Ow! <coughs> oh, Willow. Kaya... Children, I absolutely forbid you to fall in love with this baby. Don't ignore me! Kaya, I'm serious. What if we get in trouble for having her? What are we going to do? We're going to give her a bath, silly. But maybe we should take her before the village council. No! They'll think she's some kind of bad omen. They'll blame us. Me. Tomorrow is a big day for me. It's the festival. And after I do my magic act, I'm going to be picked by the High Old One to be his new apprentice. I just know it. But the High Old One hasn't chosen an apprentice in years. I know he'll pick me, and this baby isn't going to ruin it. Willow, don't yell. You'll... Oh, dear. You'd better take her. Hey, I don't want... Oh, all right. She is kind of cute. The Nelwyn Village Square. Thank you, everyone. And for my final amazing feat, I make an entire pig disappear. Whoopity ban, deru, deru. Whoa, boo, fake, fake. Squee, squee, squee. Round the bend. Me gosh, we're too old for... Come on, round the bend. Fat rear end. He's a donkey. I'm your friend. You did fine, Willow. What you need's a better pig. And a way of getting burgle cut off my back. The Nelwyn Village Council Chamber. Attention! The High Aldwyn will now choose his new apprentice from among the hopefuls. Willow Hopgood, 
Don't you get to be a hopeful? Is this a joke? Right? Forget all you know, or think you know, and trust in your intuition. The power to control the world rests in which finger? No, I'm afraid not. No apprentice this year. Eek! Rrr! Help! Mims, look out! It must have been looking for someone's baby. Be careful, Vonkar. The Nelwyn warriors quickly kill the death dog and dispose of its carcass. My children and I found this baby in the river, High Alduin. A Daikini child. Strange. I feel a most special child. It's what the beasts want. Give it to them before more come. The child must be taken to the Daikini crossroads, and the bones shall tell me by whom. The bones are silent, Willow. But tell me, do you love this child? Yes. Yes, I do. The bones have spoken! Willow, the security of this village depends on you. All praise the bones! But who will help our brave friend on his journey to protect the child from the beasts who hunt it? I'll go. No, Vonkar's the best warrior our village has. He might be needed here. I'll go. Good choice. Praise the bones. The bones have also decreed, Burglecut, that you should lead this expedition. What? If I'm going, then so's Vonkar. Next morning. But, Dada, aren't you scared? There are fairies out there, and brownies, and dragons, and trolls. Trolls. I hate trolls. I'll miss you. Take this, for luck. You cut your hair? The world is dangerous to Nelwins. Give the child to the first Ikeni you see, and hurry home. Go in the direction the bird flies. It's going back toward the village. Ah, uh, <laughs> fine. Ignore the bird. Follow the river. All right, men. Move out. Willow, what's your problem? What? When I held up my hand yesterday, what was your impulse? Your real one? It was stupid. I wanted to choose my own finger. You have the potential to be a great sorcerer. But first, you must learn to trust yourself. Here, take these. Magic acorns, whatever they're hurled at, will turn to stone. Hurry up, Buff Good, you lazy lout! Turn to stone? Even Burgle Cut? Use sorcery for evil, and you will become an evil sorcerer. I love you, Willow. Remember to keep her warm? And so. You're slowing us down, Buff Good! We have to stop. The baby... Needs a rest. She's sick. Oh no, is she going to die? Not if we stop. Whoopity bairn, deru, deru. Whoopity willow loves you. A death dog. But it's far away. We searched the Nelwyn village. A party of them is on the road with the baby. Find them and report this to Sorsha. Let's go back. Take her with us. No, that would lead them to the village. We've got to make it to the crossroads. We'll be cautious. Keep to the woods. Until at last. That's it. The crossroads. Brr. And soon the party is camped. Give me water, Peck, or die. Eee! Uh, I will water anything you say. You weasley little pecks, give me some water. What luck, he's a daikini. We can't give her to him. Somebody put him in there for a reason. But we have to give her to someone. Let me out, I'll take care of her. Kiss, kiss. see, she likes me. I trust him completely. 
Somebody's coming. We'd better hide. No! Help! Stop! Are you all right? Never better. They set me on fire. Why not give them your baby? They eat babies. That's it. We're giving him the baby and leaving. Good decision. No, Burgle Cut. Don't listen to him, Burgle Cut. I'm in charge here, and if you stay, you stay alone. But, but, Von Carr, he'll be leaving with me. No, Burgle Cut. Bad decision. Don't leave me alone here. At least give me some water. Me gosh. I'm staying. That was pretty stupid, Peck. Don't call me Peck. Peck? Peck? Peck, Peck! Listen, you. I'm a powerful sorcerer. I could throw a magic acorn at you and turn you to stone. Go ahead. I wouldn't want to waste it. Peck, 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 peck. And so it goes. Until the next morning. Morning, boys. Did I introduce myself? I'm Mad Mardigan. I'm Migosh. Stop! Wait! I wonder where he was going in such a hurry. Smells like a battle. And I suppose you're a warrior. Finest swordsman who ever lived. Sir, please, we found one of your babies. We're going into battle, little ones. Find a woman to take care of it for you. He thought you were a woman, Eric. Mad Mardigan! I always said you'd end up in a crow's cage someday. Why are you here? Bav Morda's on a rampage. Her troops massacred Galadorn and were trying to stop them at the River Troon. Let me out. Give me a sword. I'll win this war for you. After that stunt you pulled at Land's End, you're lucky I don't kill you. Rot in there. You slime! I'll be around long after you're dead! I miss Kaya and the bobbins, and we're running out of food. I'm scared, Willow. Nobody cares about your baby, except me. Go back to your families, and I'll look after her like she was my own. I believe him, Willow. But a warrior doesn't know anything about babies. But I know lots of women who do. You can't let me die here when all I want to do is protect her. Clink. Whoa! You gotta promise to feed her and keep her clean. See? She likes me. You worry too much, Peck. Willow. I mean Willow. Look, you got my word of honor. Goodbye, boys. Scree! Did we do the right thing, Migosh? Absolutely, Willow. Brownies! Look out! They've got her! Hey! Stop! Wait! Bring her back! Willow! Oh no! It's a trap! Soon. Where am I? Migosh, are you alright? I think my arm's broken. Where's that baby? She's my responsibility. Quiet, fool! I am Frangine, king of the world! And you Nellowins don't scare me, no matter how big you are! Frangine, bring the Nellowin to me. Uh-oh, it's your Lindria. Fairy Queen wants you. You're in trouble now. Shut up, rule. When I get loose, I'm gonna... Release the Nellowins. Welcome to my kingdom. Gotta go. Yipe! There you are. I can't see anything. I'm sorry. You are an honored guest here, Willow Ufgood. How do you know my name? Elora Dunnan told me. Elora, Willow's here. But she's just a baby. Elora is the daughter of the sun and moon and the future empress of all kingdoms. You mean, I can go home now? No. Elora likes you. She has chosen you to be her god. But my family needs me. So does Elora Dannon. 
she must bring about the downfall of the evil Queen Bavmorda, whose powers are growing. I would help you, but my powers are limited to these woods. Take my wand to the sorceress Finn Razel. She will help you take Laura to the kingdom of Tirislein, where the rulers will care for her. But this is a job for a warrior, not a nobody. Hello? I cannot make you go, Willow, but I ask it. Soon Bavmorda will threaten all children everywhere. Where did you steal that dust of broken heart? Nowhere. It was just having fun. Get away! Help! Throw water on her! Wake up, Migosh. It's time to go home. Home? How's your arm? Think you'll be able to make it? It's fine. Practically. They put something on it. Tell Kaya I love her and think about her every day. And tell her I'll protect the baby. You've made up your mind? Maybe I should come with you. Not with that arm. Give Mims and Ranan a hug for me, and don't let Kaya worry. Be careful. Daikinis say one thing and mean another. Hey! Round the bend! Fat rear end. He's a donkey. I'm your friend, Migosh. This way! This way! How long will it take to find this Rizelle? She's been exiled to an island just over the hills by the evil queen Bavmorda. She's what? What island? Shut up, rule! Death below! Daikinis! Here! No mercy! Whoa! Run for it! Shh! Don't cry, Laura. Things can't get any worse than this. Later. A peck! Can you spare some milk for this poor hungry baby? Beat it, Peck! Get out of here, Peck! Look at her! Now for that dust of broken heart! No! Oof! H Hello! You're so beautiful! Poof! Hist! Rear! Yipe! Splash! Glub! Get out of here, you little peck! What? Whoa! Hurry! My husband's coming! How do I look? Ow! Not you! I knew I shouldn't have trusted you! Where'd you come from? Don't I know you? Where is he? There's no one here but me and my cousin, uh, Hilda. This is my husband, Lug. How do you do? These pecks make terrible nursemaids so excitable. Give her back! Hick! Are we having a party? Wanna kiss? No, thank you. Time to leave. There are more of them in here, Sorsa. And another baby. You! Are you the mother of that child? Yes, yes, of course. Let me see it. No, don't let her! That's an order! Oof! By glory, you're beautiful. You're very strong. Thank you. Uh-oh. You're no woman. To be continued. And that is all the time I have to read the adaptation of the Willow comic. Thank you for spending time with us. We'd like to invite you to subscribe to this channel and feel free to click the like button and share this video. Until the Infernal Brotherhood convenes again, my fellow scruffy-looking nerf herders, may the Force be with you.